this review is of King Lucky Food Co Industrial Corporation Black Rice Kangi. And it's basically a porridge. Um, there are the nutrition facts. Too bad my phone never wants to focus from this side. And then I'll just kind of slowly turn this so you can try to read all that stuff there including the ingredients. This is halal, which you can see right here. And it's HACCP and ISO 22,000 uh, certified. I don't know what those mean, but I know the ISO. Let's see if I can get this open. Oh, boy, there we go. Got it! There's a nifty little spoon hidden underneath. It's a three part. All right, let's see if I can get the, the can open now. I'm using the, the spoon to help me get my finger underneath the, the pull tab. Because it's a little bit tight. Sweet. Don't try that at home, kids. <clears throat> well, let's see. I see what looks like mushroom, but can't possibly be mushroom. Oh, it must be long ones. And there are beans, and there's rice that doesn't look like black rice in here. I know what black rice looks like because I have some, and I've eaten it many times. Yeah, so this says it's black rice, but what I'm seeing is a lot of um, whatever kind of beans those were, I forgot, in here instead of black rice, and a modicum of non-black rice, as well as other ingredients. Oh, there's a, there is a little bit of black rice, but not much. They lied. Mm. Mostly it tastes like the liquid sugar cane water. Whatever the heck black sugar is. Not my personal preference uh, for a porridge or um, kangi. Um, it's okay. I'll give it a five. Thanks for watching. Oh, and this is a product of Taiwan, by the way. Thanks for watching, and I hope you have a great day.